Now then, we've been doing some maintenance on this solar boom and it's got six panels on it and it pivots around that central pole there so it's tracking so it tracks the Sun so it has a lot of benefit if you've only got a small amount of panels from mid spring to mid autumn yeah and the drive is along here and there's a wheel at the end and there's an electric motor down there and we will look at that shortly so let's get into the nitty-gritty so let's have a look these are the micro switches that limit the the movement yeah and here hopefully we can see this yeah there's a pivot there and the pivot there which allows this whole frame to pivot with the movement of the ground yeah as the wheel goes round and here we have a safety feature if for chance the wheel keeps going yeah and I'll talk about that in a minute and it goes past its stop then this tightens up and pulls this socket apart so it just stops it dead because it's between this cable is between two fixed points okay so then we have a greased thrust bearing there it's just a big lump of angle iron and another one that side and uh, and some grease and of course the weight pushes that way at the bottom and up at the top behind this there's a big bearing there's a big plumber block yeah so that takes all the the weight and this this down the bottom takes all the thrust so that sort of works and the motor is driven by a timer and the details are in this hopefully you can see that wind and solar electricity edition 4 but you'll notice there's no logo up there so this is reprinted and edited further edits so that's the one you want the one without the logo on the top corner yeah it's available at Bimble Solar or on eBay I'll put a link in the description so if you want to know about the it's a it's an interval timer that runs this motor yeah let's just spin round and zoom out okay let's just open this cover and there we are there's the motor chain drive reduction gearbox wheel so the interval timer I think at the moment this runs for 20 seconds every 25 minutes and of course it's adjustable but that seems to follow the Sun because the time is based on the Sun anyway so why follow have complicated stuff and follow the Sun when you can just have a little interval timer running and this whole system has been running for at least 10 years if I think about it I'll put a link to the first video that I did building this yeah anyway I'm keeping these videos short now because of YouTube advertising they really have gone to town and I used to have only skippable ads and now on new videos it's you get what you're given yeah full like 30 second ads 40 second ads this sort of thing I don't include mid-roll ads but still 
I used to have skippable only and now they've changed the rules and also they've reduced the payout considerably like 40 percent over the last three months four months so um, it means short videos from now on anyway comments discussion yeah be interesting to hear what you have to say yeah this whole array it's pretty amazing actually it just tickles backwards and forwards day in day out yeah backwards and forwards so it goes all the one way along this track here it goes all one way and it comes to the end and the micro switch stops it and then we have a um, a changeover switch which is just a basically a relay two pole relay and that changes over on a and on a separate plug-in timer so it changes the polarity of this DC motor and then it just chunters back all night yeah, 20 seconds every 25 minutes or something like that till it gets to the other end and then it stops and then it awaits for the the changeover relay swap over and then the next pulse it starts going the other way and look at that I knew if I kept talking for long enough it would start going there it's just chuntering away and the wheel is just moving you can just see it so there you go yeah as I say comments discussion Tell me what you about, think about the various issues that I've talked about in this video and um, I will catch up with you very soon. Yeah, If you want to know more, see the other videos or buy yourself a copy of Wind and Solar Electricity Edition for reprint. Cheers for now.